And I'm Devon Francis, the brewing manager. Um, my job is essentially to oversee the, the, the process that actually takes the raw materials and convert them into liquid, into red striped beer. Malted barley is our main raw material. It's imported from England, from France, sometimes from the United States, sometimes referred to as the, the soul of beer. And this is where we had what we call hops. Hops is actually what gives beer that bitter, refreshing taste. Red Stripe, the company actually sits on about a dozen wells. So our water is actually extracted from the water table below. This is uh, this is what we call hyperactive entertainment. You know, our little hideout, studio, office, house, everything in one. We been in a studio for a good while, you know, for maybe maybe around 2000. I was in I was in my friend's living room, like. <laughs> well, right now I'm in my friend's living room. <laughs> There's a different living room. <laughs> I'm <laughs> we do this every day, every night. There's no sleeping. Maybe, maybe an hour. Apart from that, we're, we're, oh, we're here. We're, oh, thinking about music. <coughs> Can't help it. Eat, sleep, drink music. Everything music. Yeah. My aim is to be able to voice the tune here, mix it, press it on vinyl, and, and put it out there without having to go to anybody. You know, that's, that's the aim. And this is the start of everything. I, I've never been to school for this. Never in my life. It's just a love. I'm mean, ears. Ears. Yeah. Trust me, we are blessed. We have real natural talent. Very few singers or DJ in this business can look at you and tell you that they have been to music school. Most of us don't. So it's really a natural talent given to each and every one of us. Yeah, because remember, you, you, if you want to be a teacher, you have to go to college to do that. But when it comes to music, it's a thing where we listen to the rhythm, we create our own melody, write our lyrics, and go to the studio and record it. Welcome to Uh, right now, 
you know, we're at Kilimanjaro recording studio, which is the best studio there is. You know, we are family. So it's just all about, you know, family thing, excitement, you know. Let the people see what the music is all about. You're at the right spot at the right time. Sure. Kilimanjaro Studios is the place to be. Crazy, they say that. They hear me tell you. Go south and Paul Elliot and that's that, that's so it got so the thing set up dance hall style Kilimanjaro, King James, Papa Roach, they want to talk the business, youth and promotion, yeah, all right. of the veterans, so they want to talk business. What them say? Yeah, we are back down to caveman, we are talking about we don't know what them said, name Jack Rubri. This is where it all began, dance hall style. Yeah, yeah man, so you have to keep the dance hall man. After far. This is all about Puchilo hanging out at Jaro Studio, you know? You see me, I want to me have to tell you them just go and hold it in the ghetto, you know? You have man over here, a man over here, you know, stop on me down. Oh, 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 the people from Jamaica need to have these big people around the place. How wow. mm. oh, so much money they pay on one side of the world and little Jamaica is short. Mm. So the people want money to spend, they want to help me sing that one here. That one here named wow. How mm. Poor people song. Imagine if money did that run come in at the ghetto. Tom would no shoot out him, breaking marrow. Just imagine if money did run. Yes, so what they so. Not he would not fish at peso. Money if he run come in at the ghetto, make the leopard them seat. Money if he run in a so for days and weeks to get to you. Three clothes, his clocks span them feet. Enough money in them pockets, and for me, them can't eat. So get to people want money to spend. Whoa, mm. Leopard, my name. L E O P A R D. That's me. Represent Jamaica and the world. Upset it. So anytime you see me, you ask me what I'm mm -mm. telling you what I'm going to go say again, say. MCLP no mega. I man say send Jaja love through the hills and through the valley. Send Jaja love cross the curves and the alley. Go on Udo Medi, go on Bono Kali. Don't follow them and them folly. I man say one aim we have an office people jolly. We no want to see no dead body punchally. We don't want John Tom, the canal Harry. We no want no more gun about song in the alley. So send Jaja love a little further. Send it to your mother and your father. We no send it to no sisters and your brother. Tell them if you want to hear the emperor Remember this, Jaja love was given free Unto you and unto me We never have to pay a fee So why we just can't let love be Love no one another Else it a go redder Every man a brother Give thanks and praise My name is Carl Phillips and I'm the packaging manager here at Red Stripe. My role basically is to ensure that we produce Red Stripe of the highest quality for our customers in a timely manner. That's our aim here, to package the liquid that Devon just made into a container. two types of bottles. We have bottles that are non-returnable 
and are for one trip only. However, we have returnable bottles which are used primarily in our domestic market. And these bottles should make at least seven trips. It just depends on the turnaround time of our bottle. Are you guys ready? Sir, Earth Shop is not the best. Tell them bring the evidence. Yeah. You gotta just believe that LA Lewis owned Jamaica. Yes, son? <laughs> That's the first thing. That's the first thing that comes to your mind. When you travel all over Jamaica, from Negril to Kingston to Moran Point to Buff Bay, the country is just LA Lewis country. You see? This, this one now, um, this one been here for like ages. It don't get dim, it just get bright every year. <laughs> Yeah, yeah. I'm one of the guys who, who roll with Prince Charles, Z Prince Charles, you know, the next king of the world in the Western atmosphere. I designed this jacket um, with the Red Shop logo, Seven Star General, because um, I just know that the Red Shop is just the Seven Star. They, um, in the army, they stop the, um, the, the stars at five, but with the Red Shop, I gotta bring it at seven, you know, it's just, just the top of the level. You, you don't get higher than us. My mother started boiling roots when I was a little boy. And I was with a man who, who do like science, medicine. I cook the medicine. Like bush the doctor. Farm and the bush doctor. Bush doctor. Like Brian Sarsiperilla, strong back medina. You have iron roots, you have blood roots, you got like coconut roots, young banana, you got sarsiperilla, you got man wish. Olivia to clean and build, to drive away gas, coal and pain, and for nature. That silent river, you know? Silent deep river. Silent river. That's the name of the roots. Guys, how's that man? We hear man, we drink roots every day. <laughs> right? Yeah. You see sit on the market over there. Just getting some things together, you know. Um, my name is Western Fisher. Well, them yeah, that's everybody know me as Mobile. Because before I come from Mobile, so and him get get me work at DNG, then just say I'm Mobile son, so me just, them name stick on me. I really a sign artist still, but the, the, the latest that now is graphic artist. But as I said, I don't really matter the name. We call as long as we get the work done. White. Purple. I don't need that. I think now everything I need just now. I started from when I was like a... From my youth, I used to get a lot of beaten for it, you know. I used to draw up a lot into my book. I used to get a beaten for it. Because at first, before, people used to tell me, no money, nothing to this. What are you doing? This is wasting the time. Just have mark up your book. And up to this time, everything that I have now is through painting. And what I really like about it, you meet a lot of people, you get to know a lot of places, you understand? And like do these things, and people comment here, and you, you feel, like, yes, you feel motivated, you feel like, yeah, you really must do it because people like to see things look good. I 
we do that, we don't write the red stripe, but we don't want, we want overpower it. You understand? We try just, just drop it in, make it look like this is, you will see a race with a red stripe sign on it. We don't want to kill it. Yeah, I come up with a design. And what what they really tell me that is they want something to do with what red stripe um, deal with, like even the racers. And you find so most of the time, if you ask somebody what they're drinking, if you say a beer, it's, it's just red stripe. Unless you tell them, give me a Heineken. But it must be a red stripe. And that's my favorite drink also. If the crime rate too high, I'm gonna run away Cause that's no place for me Only God can work miracles So beg him work one for we And just believe People are say Why Jamaica have feel locked down Every time when a criminal shot down Is it because them are the big top gun I make the police force and soldier back down Jamaica is the island of paradise where everybody wanna be But the crime rate too high People are run away Cause that's no place away hey. Only God can work miracles So hey. we're gonna make him work hey. one for me hey. Make him believe hey. Yeah hey. Let me stay here I used to drive this truck I used to drive this truck all, yeah, all over the island And I, I used to tour With a lot of artists mm -hmm. Used to be on the road with a lot of artists I play bass Right so the name truck back come from my artist friends. Put the studio in here. And I said, what are we gonna call the place? I don't know, I have no clue. And he said, where are you? Truck back, you know. And then the name just stick. I don't know, they have the truck and the space. And I said, yo, instead of putting up a building and a nice structure and everything and that, just use the truck. And inside, yeah, you would never believe that you're inside of the actual truck back. When you go inside of the truck back, is what I say. But it is a large place. See what I say? That is a very unique idea to put it in here. Because that is a, that when you, as an artist, things like that will give you a vibe to uh, complete your lyrics, complete, give you a vibe to express yourself better. Always thinking about music. Always. Some music thing. Something, something about music. I'm not gonna move. Keep it kind of, what do you call it? Organic? Organic. Yeah, <laughs> keep it organic. That's the real thing because here, what? That is the true vibe of the music. True vibe of the music. When you, you, you sit down, you see outside, everything. You sing about the tree, you sing about that, you sing about the thing on the car. You know what I mean? Something you always find things to, 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 to occupy time to focus on, meditate on. I don't have a clock in there because time, time, there's no time in there like that. Time doesn't exist inside there. I have recorded here a once before, I believe. Once before. It was just a dub play, is what I say. When you sing it, it's not the rhythm that is going to carry the, the words. Because a lot of times you have some very songs that some song that not very good, but because the rhythm is good, it will carry the song. I want the lyrics to be good enough that if I just say the lyrics, you can connect with the lyrics without having to have the beat to carry the music. I have a, a good creative ability to come up with lyrics on this spot. That's what I say. I have things in my head like, no, I should write, I write it down, but I want to make sure I get a certain thing together before I put it. When, you, when I say it, it has to be as punchy as possible. So I go on it, even if I go on stage and I sing the song, 
the people are supposed to be able to react to it. That is how I write the lyrics. I write it for stage show. I normally buy the stage show this time, the place Marshall. I leave. I don't need another verse. But I can get <laughs> <laughs> Away, I love J.A. Away, I love J.A. From 900 to the man, it is fine. On my wife, old wife, so my 999. Only why I don't sleep with is 69. Not a man, did I ever touch this behind? You live your life, I will live mine. See? Away. A murder. A murder. Yeah. <laughs> Salah Zimbo. All right. That will tell you, you know. Away, I love J.A. Away, I love J.A. Don't worry about the crime and violence. It is time for you to get yourself together. You. Hey. This place can be nice even if your head lies. It's twice the gas price. Hey. The cake is here so get sliced. Even though life tight like rich vice. You will be in house 3 o'clock. You will check the light cutter. Hey. Try go and bed by 6 water cutter. Hey. Try go port more with flood the road cutter. You be to tell somebody to steal. Away I love J.A. Away I love J.A. Away I love J.A. Then everybody said, we never know you had waves in Jamaica. I said, yeah, I know, because you were just looking at the posters of Negril. Oh. You know, so that's why you never know so we have waves in Jamaica. But we have all kind of waves oh, in Jamaica. Oh, you know what I mean? Yeah. But it's not in the safe area. It's not in the tourism, you know, approved boundaries. You know, where they're going to say, well, I don't know if you should go out there you know, the, it's pretty far away from the security that we provide here at the hotel, luxury spa, or whatever it is, you know what I mean? So them kind of try to scare people into staying there and spending all the money there and, you know, not, don't, you might go out there and find out you can get a meal for five bucks instead of 20. You know, we don't want you to go in out there. You know what I mean? You might find you can stay somewhere for 30 bucks a night instead of 150, you know? And you might find it's a nicer beach and the people are more friendly, you know? And not everybody's not all in your face trying to sell you a big bunch of beads or something. You know what I mean? You might find people looking at you as a, a curiosity, you know? And if you're not afraid of people coming up to you and say, where you from, man? Because they don't get to see people like that every day. So you get a different experience. You know, but it's just a different vibe, you know. So most people don't know about surfing in Jamaica. Them don't, them never see the guy coming into the area and driving in and stopping at the local bar and buying a round of drinks and talking to the people and making a friend and asking some local fisherman, is there anywhere where there's good ways? And say, yeah, come with me. You can leave your car at my house and walk down here and out there is where, you know. They don't picture that. They picture the worst case scenario. Because if one worst case scenario arise, then everything is spoiled, you know what I mean? This is downtown. Them GC kick on a hundred percent We can pay the light water bill nor the rent Who a bill a house a can't find no cement That's why me say fee bun parliament anyway But yet every time we check a house up on the street Them said them police go kick our feet And take our boots and they treat we like tea For the hell they respect we fee eat What about us? What about sunshine? What about rain? Oh, what about
turning into that turn now, still quick on the tempo now, explosive peak driven to stay close, toward the outside, formerly goal begins to inch forward, one Seattle girl moving into the slot, to the stretch, running the mile, two furlongs remaining, chased all the while by explosive peak, clockwork will have to stop, he's clear of explosive peak now, drifting off a true line, Seattle girl racing against the rail, it's clockwork still under the hand ride, inside the final furlong, Charlie Hussey having a peep in his mirrors as 16th remaining and Blockwork tail spinning now in the end is being shown the right hand stick and comes away to take the red stripe mile by five. Seattle's girl is second, Explosive Peak is third, Exclusive run fourth. 10, 1, 9 and 6 the numbers here. Ta -da, ta -da. Well, I'm a customer assistant. Whenever these bottle purchase, I've make sure that the right amount have been purchased and make sure that they are in good condition to go back on the line. Well, basically what really happens um, during the year, people have a tendency to save up their, their bottles just to get exchange of drinks for the end of year, for the festive season. So like for instance, they're having like jerk and family coming to spend their Christmas holidays so they try to get some drinks and, and liquor beverages to party. So basically, this is the time where people bring out all their stuff, all their bottles. So you take a liquor, buy a tree, buy three crates, put it down there, might finish for two days or so. I'm out of workers in that crew. So it goes on and on. Save them in one place. We're gonna end the year now. Change out. How long did it take to get this many? Well, I can't how we buy them. We buy like three, four, yeah. every time. For the week. It's about from January. Just for the bot, like three cases a week. Yeah. What do you think so long he's on the work side? He's have to wait after work in the evening. He's have to wait after work. He's on the work, he buy them. He cannot drink during the day. When he's after work, then he can take right. one or two. Oh, you're cool. Okay, look at here. 151 cases. I'm <laughs> <laughs> 40, <and> 40 empties. <laughs> <laughs> Must be a long time, right? <laughs> 40. 40. 40. Yeah. Empty, 